Sound in wind and limb, I'll say that for him. Get up! How old are you? Fifteen, I think, sir. You think? You're eighteen if you're a day. I'm not eighteen, sir. If no. I say you're eighteen, you're eighteen. Find him. You're very lucky. I'm giving you the chance to defend England against tyranny. But I'm Welsh. Don't quibble. Damn. He's not coming, Grandfather. I don't understand the boy. We were doing so well, so very well. He seemed really interested. You mustn't be too disappointed. Honest, he's restless. He wants excitement. He wants to be with Jack Vincent. You'd been halfway around the world at his age. And I'd never opened a book. My schoolroom was the deck of a ship. Such a wonderful child, Sarah, among those islands. The colors, the sounds, the green-black forests. Now that was an education, my dear. Mr. Vincent, sir. Honesty won't be coming for his navigation lesson today, Captain. What happened? The press gang's got him. No. But he's too young. I was put on the ship's books when I was still in the nursery. So why are you angry? Who says I am? The boy was useful to me. He's wild. I'll break him. I've seen it done, they'll have to. I shall seek a writ of habeas corpus. On what grounds, Captain? That the whole principle of impressment is an invasion of personal liberty. We'll get short shrift from the Admiralty. Pressing has been complained about since England had a navy. Then why does it continue? Men of war must be manned. It's worse than kidnapping. How can it be justified? The safety of the state. Ah, yes, of course. Such a useful phrase. But stop 
talking politics. What about honesty? There's nothing we can do. Well, there must be. Nothing. Who are they? Magistrate sent them, sir. I'll have no criminals. Well, smugglers, sir. Good seamen. Very well. Put these rogues in the lockup. And this one with them. Oh, hold for it! safety of the state. Coming here? I don't know. I don't think so. They took me to the Raven. The rendezvous, they called it. Rendezvous, that's French. Let me stay here, Captain Koenig. I can easily get to Mr. Jack's cottage after dark. They'll never catch me then. They're here. Quickly, take it from the back of the house. Williams, Jenkins, back of the house. Yes? We're after a deserter, ma'am. He was seen running to this house. A deserter? I'm a press master, ma'am. May I enter? No, sir, you may not. You are exceeding your authority. I doubt it. It's signed by the Lord's Commissioners of Admiralty. Do you question their authority? Is this your house, ma'am? My grandfather's. Then I wish to see him. This is disgraceful. I apologize. Leave this house immediately. When I have spoken to your grandfather. Grandfather, this officer... My name's Scott Punsonby, sir. Walter Koenig. I have reason to believe a young deserter is hiding somewhere within this house, and so I ask your permission to search it. A deserter? From which ship? From no ship, sir. He was pressed and escaped. But surely, Lieutenant, the man would have to be on the ship's books to be called a deserter. That is hardly relevant. I'm afraid it is, Lieutenant, and I believe you know it. So now, would you kindly leave my house? There is no deserter here. Immediately, sir. Immediately, I have your word that you are not sheltering the person I seek. Well, sir? I give you my... They didn't know he was here. I came in the back way. 